Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to show you how you can use Tone Wallet Connect adapter or component in a React application. So here I've created an empty folder and there I'm going to install uh, React and React Tom. So it's going to be like this and then I'm going to put index.js here as an entry point to our application and it's similar to any any other uh, React application where I just go to simply uh, create a inner HTML and then hello. And then after this, I can run start command. Uh, and let's see the command scripts. So there are no scripts here. So I'm going to put uh, here start and say react script start. So this will do this strategy and maybe I can uh, install this one also, React Script. Okay, I think the React Script is... Um, using Script to start. Okay, uh, okay, it's installed. And then React yeah, script now from and we have the screen. Okay, I guess we did a typo here. And it's gonna be scripts. And uh, same thing happens here. We don't that's right. It's going to take some time to install the application, but it should be done in a minute. So Let's wait for this and meanwhile we can just remove this. Okay. Not, not now. Okay, so now it has been installed and we can remove this. This was not the correct script. And uh, now we're going to run this and say, sorry, uh, change this one also. Okay. So we have to create, uh, like this is just basics and I'm just doing this for you too. Uh, index .html. Okay. So uh, in the index.html, we have to just put some dummy, uh, you can say HTML. So this is the React app. Index not steaming and now it should work. Uh, Searching is okay, so it needs the index not steaming to be in the SRC folder. Move and now down. The next like default situation. Yes.
So I'm going to bring my browser here. So now you can see it says hello world and we can make changes to this. So I'm going to not tell you that uh, uh, how you can create component and how you can arrange uh, your React application. That is something you already know. So just to confirm that we are on the right track, you can see the changes here that we are coming up with. Now I'm going to install another package, uh, which is responsible for Dawn Wallet Connect. So it goes like this. Uh, Dawn. Dawn Connect. So yeah, this is correct. So I'm just arranging this thing. Okay, so I'm gonna move it here. Okay, so here below the Hello YouTube, I'm gonna use, uh, I'm gonna wrap my application. So before anything, I'm gonna wrap, so I'm gonna provider, there's a provider. And then you ask for a manifest URL. The manifest URL is a JSON file, which I'm gonna show you how does it look like. So all you need to do is to create a JSON file like this. Uh, you can see URL name, icon URL, terms of use URL, privacy policy URL, everything. And you can have your own URL here. You can host it on S3 and just use the links here. And I'm gonna use this link uh, like the link of this file that I'm just showing you, not the, the URL, but also the URL of the manifest.json where you have hosted your manifest version, which is this. Okay, so just to see that we are on the right track, we're gonna rerun this application to make sure that it's not encountering any issue. And we're gonna say yes. Um, good yeah, so it's working fine without any issue you can see uh, so the next thing we're going to do is uh, inside this wrapper since we are only having single page so uh, we're going to use here only to put our button okay So I'm going to put on connect button. Okay. Okay, so I think these are just warnings. And so I'm going to pull up the application here. And now you can see that the button has appeared after this. And if you click on this, you can see that these are the options which you can select to connect and we're gonna make it quick and I'm gonna use my uh, telegram for this. So if I get open wallet in telegram, uh, so it would open my telegram app and I can't share you my telegram app screen, but uh, I can easily connect there. So if once I connect there, it would automatically pull up my wallet address. You can see that it's a bit uh, cutting the edges. So maybe we can just uh, make it in a div. And go like this. And we can put a uh, style here. Then padding, maybe of 10 orient. 
This is for just the testing purpose. Okay. So if we do that, let's see if it makes any changes. Okay, yeah, so you can see the button here and the options are clearly visible now. I can disconnect and then I can connect again. So that was all. That was how you can set up a connect wall button in your React app for the Dawn network. I'm going to make more videos on this, how to get the balance, how to get the, how to create a token using a script and in your React application. Please subscribe and let me know if you want more content like this. Thank you. Bye-bye.